This is a Mike Phoenix. Unboxing. Hey everyone, welcome to an unboxing of the Winged Dragon of Ra Egyptian God Statue by Koto Bukia. Um, as you can see, it's a big box, just like the Slifer that we unboxed a couple months ago. Um, so just going through like the different sides of the box. Um, you can see these have images. Um, here they have like a sneak peek of Slifer and Obelisk. And then another image of the statue itself. Again, it's a pretty big box. You can see like, it's not small. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna unbox it off screen. Um, this is what the inside looks like. Each side, and again, there's two halves. So each side is triple protected. I don't know if the layers are coming through, but there's three layers. And the more delicate parts have styrofoam. Again, can, like right there, if you can see it. And each part, and most mostly the wings are individually wrapped. So there wouldn't be any issues during transit if you're getting this straight from Japan, like I did. Um, but yeah, let me take out the parts individually. Now they have all the pieces separate. As you can see, the body is into three parts. The body, I guess the torso, the tail, the head, two wings, and then the base plate and two stands. So now we'll do a 360 spin on it. Um, it looks pretty good. I have two complaints. One is that there was a piece of paint missing and I'll show you when I do the close up. And also this wing right here, it was hard to put in. It looked like maybe the molding was a bit off for that wing because the other one went in easily and then stayed in. That one was just giving me trouble going in. And um, Ra does have parts that move. So his legs move all the way back, all the way front. So um, his feet slash claws go like that. And yep, his arms as well, his claws go that all the way back. And his hand, like his wrist, so he can move his elbow and then his wrist as well. And then his entire arm as well. So I don't know if you want to make it look like he's flying like supersonic speed, maybe like that. But I think the main pose people are gonna have it in is him like like he's just arriving to the scene. And I'll be doing the close up now. And for reference, this is where the paint is missing. It came like that out the box. Um, it wasn't like I hit it anywhere or anything. It's unfortunate, but it's not really noticeable when you're looking at the statue from the front. Overall, I like the statue. I think my issues with it is just mine came a little bit defective, kind of like I mentioned and showed was the paint being chipped. And I think the mold for this one was not done correctly for that wing. Overall, it looks nice. I really like the details taken in account into it. Um, definitely have the money. I do think it will be a nice collection. This is way better than any pop or I guess other officials, official statues I've seen of the Wing Dragon or Raw. And um, as a bonus, I'll be showing Raw and Cypher side by side. Thanks for watching. As always, leave a like and comment. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. Thanks, and let me know what you guys want to see in the future.